Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. I am your hostess with the mostest, Anna. How are you guys doing? And my channel name is Only My Dreams. If you enjoy your stay, and if you like what you see, I hope you subscribe, become a part of the family, and give my video a thumbs up, okay? So let's go ahead and get into this. Um, one of the first things that I found that I was like, oh, old school, very old school. You're seeing this right. Tom and Jerry, baby. Who remembers Tom and Jerry? I used to sit and watch Tom and Jerry as a kid. <laughs> I love Tom and Jerry. I love what was um, Dale and Chip, the squirrels. I used to love them. I used to love the Smurfs. Yeah, th those were all my jam. So there you go. <laughs> I found a Tom and Jerry Life is Sweet bag. And it's by Legacy. Legacy Bags. So that was the coolest find ever. Love. My life is complete. Tom and Jerry, baby. Love it. Then the next things that I um, picked up, let's do some foodie finds. Um, because I think it's really important to always build up our pantries whenever we can, wherever we are. And um, especially now with, with prices rising, let's go ahead and get our pantry stocked up. So I did find the Morrison's Texas Style Honey Sweet Cornbread Mix. Um, this is a 16 ounce. They have that available right now. They've had those there before. I've seen them there before like a year ago and they just brought them back. Okay, so there you go. If you like them, they have them there again. It's a very big, heavy package. I only picked up one. Then I saw a lot of you hauling and sharing the Helper Mac. Do, 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 do. Okay, so I'll do it like this. Helper Mac City. So they had three flavors. They had um, now with more cheese. And they had uh, bold cheesy, bold and spicy, and bold pepper jack. So bold pepper jack, bold spicy, and bold cheesy pizza. Cheesy pizza. So it's three different flavors. I went on ahead and got them. The best buy dates for these are May of 2023. I just picked up three to see if the boys like it. Um, I've never tried Helper Mac and Cheese before. It says it microwaves within three minutes and 30 seconds. So I don't know. We'll check it out. And the best buy date for the uh, for the Texas style honey sweet cornbread mix is May of 2023. Okay. Now, um, my daughter picked these up because she wanted to try them. The top ramen is a five pack, the chili flavor. And she picked that up so they could try it. Then she also picked up some of the Junior's Most Fabulous Brooklyn Blend Medium Ground Coffee Roast. She picked up two of these, actually. And then... She also chose to get the um, Cafe Aroma Premium Espresso Coffee. So she picked up that one as well. The Espresso Coffee. She's really excited to try this one. Then uh, it's so hot in here, you guys. My house is like, oh, it's hot right now. I just came in with the boys. So it's kind of like, it's like a whirlwind. I got two more packs of the chocolate chips because I was there. They were there. And I bought them because we can use them. And I'm, I'm just buying stuff wherever I'm at, you know, because I'm not going to go all the way to Walmart that's a half an hour away to save 15 cents, you know, and, and stay in the lines and waste gas. I, I do it the way it makes sense for me and my family. Then I did pick up two bags of the Pampa Whole Egg Noodle, okay, and all natural ingredients, eight minute cooking time, 12 ounce. If you guys have a recipe that you think I should try um, to make these, let me know what your recipe is for the egg noodles. So I haven't cooked with egg noodles in like forever. I haven't. So I decided to go ahead and pick some up. Then I did pick up some more of the Greta crackers, the vegetable garden. This has a buttery buttery taste and vegetable taste combo and my kids like these i keep these upstairs they are like individually wrapped in packs of like two i think or three so they're very convenient to use okay so i think is that it for the food 
Lord, that's it for the food. Okay, so now let's do Christmas items, okay? I was able to find some of the lit up Christmas trees. I made sure I turned them on before I left to make sure they worked. And they work. Yay! So I got two. They had the different colors, but I wanted the green. So I got two of the green. And uh, they had like the was it like a gray and some other color? I, I don't know. But I got two of them for my dollhouse miniatures. Super excited to have come across those again. So I got two. Then um, I did pick up in the kids department the pet accessories. Collect them all. Um, it's six pieces. And as you can see, it does have like uh, two cats. Is it two cats? Is one a dog or is one a cat? I can't tell. One's a cat. I don't know if the other one's a dog. You guys tell? I don't know, but um, it has, yeah, the little carrier. And then it has a little bed. And then the little, you know, grooming and the little bowl. So I figured I could use that for my dollhouse miniatures. Of course, I would cover up the bed in some fabric. So it actually would look like you could find it in a dollhouse, in an actual house. And um, this, I might paint it. So I was like, let me see what I can do with it. Let me see. Okay, back to Christmas. Sorry. Sorry. I found this. This, <laughs> my daughter saw this and she was like, Mom, this kind of creepy. And I was like, But I liked it. It was the owl. <laughs> she was like, It's creepy looking. Uh, I liked it. And it, it hangs like that. I only got one and um, it's very fluffy and furry and it sits on the little thing. I just thought it was different. You know, so I wanted to add that to my Christmas tree stuff. Then I did get the little metal sign because um, I like to put these on baskets and things that you can just change up a look of a basket and it's metal. So you could put it outside like on a porch. Um, it says Farm Fresh Christmas Trees and it looks like a little tag. I love that. Then um, I did pick up the joy to the world little wooden faux wood or real wood around the outside not real wood on the back <laughs> but I thought it was pretty so I got it and it doesn't take up too much space so I picked it up I just I was feeling it when I saw it I was definitely feeling it then for the last I think this is the last Chris no it's not I have two more things I picked up another of the hair uh, cause they're like clips for the hair, but I'm going to take them apart from my dollhouse. So I found another one that didn't look really, really messed up because a lot of them are kind of messed up. So I found one that didn't look too bad, too shabby. So I picked up another one of those for my dollhouse. Then I did find the, the big, um, floor mats. Now I do not recommend that you actually use these as a floor mat unless you're going to put it on top. Of another carpet because these do slide you will fall and you will get hurt unless you're going to get that rubber backing stuff to put behind it some people put hot glue all over it to help help it adhere to us to a floor so it won't slide um, I like to put these on a table where I'm sitting where I'm working and even on my craft table so I got this really pretty happy holidays and I got the green one and it says North Pole Tree Farm. Hope you guys can see it. There we go. North Pole Tree Farm. So those are the two that I picked out because um, I like to I like to use them on my tables and not on the floor. That's me. Then let me put my bag, my Tom and Jerry bag, right here too. Put it right here. Put it right here. Um, just a heads up. I just released a Avon haul with all kinds of things from Avon and AMA Avon representative. I'm also a Sensi representative so I can take care of all your Sensi and Avon needs. I'll put that video up here so you can see all the newest stuff that I picked up and some really pretty jewelry and new hair products I'm really excited about. I will be reviewing. I got an Ulta haul and I picked up the Revolution, the um, School of Good and Evil perfumes. I picked them both up. And I tried them today. So I'm going to be doing a review on these on a separate video. Just a heads up on those two perfumes. Um, if you watched the movie 
Uh, it's, it's the school of good and evil. It was a really good movie. So I had to get those fragrances and those are available at Alta. So just a heads up. I'm going to release that within a couple of days. Okay. Back to the Dollar Tree. Back to the Dollar Tree. I did find the Kylie, the Kendor and Kylie little bags. They had all of them. I only picked up one. Um, cause I, I like the way these are to hold and move my my thing here. I thought I had a brush. Yeah, here's one of my brushes. That this would be nice to because I like to keep things upstairs and downstairs. So it'll hold my brushes. And I'm like, okay, I need my brushes. Um to start putting on my makeup. Today is too hot. It would just literally melt off me. So I didn't put any makeup on today since I just came in. But they do have the bags and there will be great little, you know stocking stuffers you know for someone special in your life or just for yourself now um that's kind of like beauty so let's stick to beauty my daughter picked up the ponds a perfect color complex anti-marks for natural color um normal to dry skin beauty cream and that's name brand ponds and this is a 1.35 ounce so that's a four she also picked up the foot mask by Be Pure. She likes to do foot masks. She wanted to try that one out. She found the China Glaze and she got the Tree Hugger color. This is called Tree Hugger. And she knew I was going to like it too. She was like, Mom, we can share. And then this one, I don't know what color this is. This is, yeah, yes. This is yes. I can't read it. Yes, it's green. And this is the um, Instant Dry Pride Sally Hansen. So she got these two really pretty green colors for herself. Then I picked up the Lip Smackers. They had a couple of different kind of Lip Smackers. I love lip balms. I do have some lip balms that I ordered from EOS that I'm going to be sharing with you guys. Uh, this is the Cinnabon Cinnabons. And I love lip smackers. I love EOS. Anything that just, you know, can take care of your lips. It has a fun, a fun smell and flavor. I'm all in. So Cinnabon, I had to get it. And then they had like the, the usual ones, but this one was different. So I picked this up for me. Then um, I also saw, I didn't see any of the Disney lip bumps that people have been sharing. Uh... Not this kind, but the kind that are like round. I haven't seen any of those. So I'm going to keep my eye out for that. Um, this is called Candy Cane Swirl. And it is a lip balm. I might give this to my kiddos for Christmas. And a stocking stuffer. And this one's Mint Hot Chocolate. Mint Hot Chocolate. And it's by Disney. So there you go. Then... um. I did pick up some hair ponytail holders. I call them hair bows. I love the super bright colors, as you can tell. So I got those for me. And I like to use these kind. And I like to use the bigger ones, too. As you can tell, I have a big one here. Because um, they don't break my hair. It's just easier. Then I got this one to use as a bigger one for my hair. Because my hair is kind of on the thick side. So I got these. And then um, they had the Wet n Wild. Now, you guys, uh, everybody's been showing the new LA Colors uh, new line of cosmetics and they got brand new packaging. They have some, um, new interesting items. I'm not picking those up. And let me tell you why I get two boxes from BoxyCharm and I'm thinking about subscribing, getting rid of one of box, one of my BoxyCharm box subscriptions and getting a different one. Uh, I get a lot of name brand, really nice, sometimes high end cosmetics in those, in those boxes. So I'm kind of, you know, I'm kind of leaning off of um, certain cosmetics because I, I get them on a monthly basis. So I'm being a little bit more picky, basically. Uh, but I did pick up the Wet n Wild Color Icon. I thought that this was really pretty. I thought those colors were really pretty because it's like a purple. I know it's hard to see. It's like a purplish, purplish color there on the top. I thought that that would be a nice thing to try. Then, um, let me see what else. Okay, this is my daughter's. Then for, oh, food item. I almost forgot to share this with you, foodie. 
they had ground sage by Kelowna. So I picked up the ground sage. They had that available. Careful, Bubba. Then um, in a crafty department and a pen department. They have the fuzzy pens back again. And I love, did I not say, I love, 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 love these pens. They're so comfortable and cozy to write with. And they bring me so much joy and, and it makes me want to draw and it makes me want to write and to journal because it's just so comfortable and it does write well. So I was happy to see they came back with them and they're just so fun. So I got two of those from me, for me, for me, for me. Then I did pick up the car hooks from my car. So um, I could lay my purse right there and hold my purse and not let it sit on the floor, you know. So I got those with the stars. They had like two or three different designs, but that's the one I got. Then they also came back with the funnels, but it's a three pack before they only had a two pack, but now they have a three pack of the funnels. And these are great when you're using what your beads and other things and your glitter. So you got them on a paper or a little thing, and then you want to get them back into the container. You funnel it back in and it goes right into the container. These are great to use for crafting. I was able to find the green ones, the green rhinestones. Um, my last Dollar Tree haul, I'll put it up here. So you can see the different, the other different color rhinestones I was able to find, but I didn't have the green. And the rhinestones are absolutely gorgeous. And I do collect vintage jewelry, so sometimes you need to make repairs. So it's nice to be able to find some rhinestones. Then they also had the paint and water, the paint and water crafter square cup now i got two of these because a this is like awesome you put whatever paint that you have in there you can do your different color combinations for the different things that you might be working on at one time so i got two of them because you know they come out with this kind of stuff and then you like never see it again and i was like okay i have to have at least two of these i have to then um i did find the disco LED disco light. Now, a lot of people reviewed these and they said it was awesome. And I was like, okay, I need to keep my eye out. And they had this in a weirdest place. They had it in the automotive department with the, with the car stuff. I know. Sometimes they do stuff. That's why you have to walk the whole store because they do stuff that doesn't make sense. They put things in places that you would never ever think of finding an LED disco ball in a next to the car supplies this was there then um i did get this container i'm not too sure if i shared this before so i'm sharing it again um but they come in different colors i got the hot pink i like to use this for my dollhouse miniatures i'll tell you why um anything that that has to deal with paper frames artwork mirrors um this is a great way to hold them uh right here you could put, you know, for whatever project or current room project, you could put the little papers and the cutouts from magazines and from books and from whatever catalogs that you've collected to make pictures for the wall right here. Then you could put the wood pieces or the frames that you might want to use here at the bottom and then match them up for whatever, you know, whatever uh, thing you're working on. I know. I love it. <laughs> I got an LED light. Um, this does turn on and off with the sun. This one's a good one. So I got that for the hallway. And then lastly, I did pick up one book, which I started to read. And it sounds like a pretty good book. Um, this is called The Lost Diary of Venice. This is by um, Margot DeRoe. I think I already have a book from her and I liked it. And this goes for $27. And that's it. That's everything for this haul and everything I picked up. So I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.